so I've been attempting to grow mushrooms for a while now. I've fruited kits that were sent to us, buried spawn and garden beds, done mushroom buckets, but there's just one thing. I was just following directions and I didn't really understand what I was doing. Do you see any mushrooms growing in there yet? No, not yet. I'm hoping we did it right, but I have no idea really what to look for. And we got this guy, but we didn't put any sports for that. <laughs> That's Skin wild. Though. <laughs> So I decided to take an online course with Fungi Academy to finally understand the why behind mushroom growing. Hey and welcome to the Fungal Ecology course. It's so good to have you here and we're finally kicking off this project we've been working on for a very long time. And super stoked to have you here. When we first moved off grid, we knew we wanted to grow our own food. And I know I wanted mushrooms to be a big part of that. Squash. Look at this, we got all these watermelons growing. Now we have had some success growing mushrooms, but it was mostly by luck and chance that they did well. If something went wrong, we had no idea how to troubleshoot it. So the hope is through this Fungi Academy course, I can stop wasting time and start growing mushrooms smarter. I'm looking forward to switching my attention from this intense heat that we've been having. It's been brutal. It's been up to 115 degrees inside the dome and a little unbearable. So before I can sit down comfortably inside and actually take this course, I got a little preparation work to do. It's hot in here. It's about 96 degrees. It makes it almost unbearable to do anything in here. survival at this point. <laughs> <laughs> Good, huh? Yeah, it's already 20 degrees cooler inside in there than it is out here, which is awesome. It's working. Mm. Now that we finally have reprieve from the sun, I can finally take this course without distraction. Welcome to the Fungal Ecology Course. bunch of new words <laughs> it's just it's cool though i like this course yeah it's fun the graphics are great the editing the production value is top notch so i'm is um good over the next few days i dive deep into the world of fungi Our first cayenne pepper is ready. <laughs> ever. Ever, right. No, ever. This is awesome. It's hard to tell if it smells real hot, but I bet it is. <laughs> With a new understanding of mycelium, I put some of this new knowledge to work. Burying these blocks full of mycelium is going to have a lot of benefits for these trees. It's going to improve the soil health, help with retention. Boy, it's hot. <laughs> Moisture retention. And hopefully, we get a couple flushes of mushrooms as a added benefit. So. 
That would be cool. Oh uh, yeah, absolutely. I'm choosing these spots because I already got wood chips all over it, so I can bury it with that. The soil's already moist. And honestly, mycelium, I've come to learn, is extremely interesting. The one thing I've learned is as the mycelium spreads through the soil, it helps break down organic matter and helps with nutrient cycling. I'm really glad that you are learning something at the Academy. Yeah, it, the course is pretty awesome. Fungal Academy made it so the information is really easy to absorb and it's fun doing it because it's a lot of information coming at you. You're going to have to take this course over a long period of time. I'm going to take it two or three times just because there's so much to learn. But once you get the vocabulary down, right? The vocabulary is a bit tricky. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it, it's high level. It's like high level mycology that they're teaching you. So right. Scientific names and stuff like right. that. Right. And just the, the ins and outs, the whys, the hows yeah. of mushrooms, mycelium, and how it impacts the environment around us. It's, it's, it's pretty interesting stuff. I never thought I would be this interested in mushrooms, but... I'm glad you are. Yeah. It's a cool hobby. And a fruitful one. And a fruitful one because this could be a major benefit in our off-grid food supply. Some people say that mycelium-rich soil is a deterrent to pests. Like we have a fire ant infestation here and it's, it's kind of hard to deal with. They take over everything. I know there's no scientific evidence to actually prove that from what I saw, but it's worth a try. But in this course, they do have a section on the zombie ant. It's a, there's a parasitic fungi that actually attacks ants. And I wonder if we can do some experimentation with that to keep the fire ants away. I got to do a lot more research. I'm going to go back and watch that discussion again. Probably email Fungi Academy and ask what their thoughts are and see if it works. Because I, I really would like to get rid of the, the fire ant infestation. It's bad. I'd always be biting my wife in the garden. <laughs> It's been hot. It's, I'm sweating. It's sad out here. The humidity, it's high, but that's actually good for growing mushrooms. The sky looks pretty behind you. Yeah. Yes, it does. <laughs> These are some reishi mushroom that I grew. I'm going to make a tincture out of it for the second time. Ever since I started taking this course at Fungi Academy, I've been experimenting with mushrooms in all different kinds of ways. For instance, <laughs> this is another tincture I made, but with some local moonshine. <laughs> you can see a lot darker. This has been sitting for a little while, so we'll see how these both turn out. But can't wait to be growing all kinds of medicinal mushrooms that will benefit our health here off grid. So in the beginning of the video on the screen there was a question whether or not I thought I was going to be able to grow mushrooms off grid by learning from Fungi Academy. I think the answer is a resounding yes. The best part about this course is Fungi Academy has all the answers I need all in one place instead of having to search all around the internet for all the answers when a problem comes up. I want to give a very special thanks to Fungi Academy. Thank you for believing in me and introducing me to the world of fungi. I invite everybody to follow me on this journey as I delve deeper into this world and learn to grow mushrooms of all different kinds. If you yourself are interested in growing mushrooms and don't know where to start, I do highly recommend this course so far. My knowledge has grown exponentially since I started taking it, and I know I need to go back and take it a few more times to really absorb all the information, but it, it's a great place to start, and I highly recommend it. Our affiliate link will be in the description of this video. Make sure to follow along and watch me on this journey with Fungi Academy. And like they say at Fungi Academy, much love everybody. I'll see you next time and keep growing.